Well, this is the moment we have all been waiting for. Ted is at the Scotiabank Saddle Dome this morning, helping the Flames get ready for puck drop. Now, Coach Ted is talking to <laughs> Coach Hartley. Uh, Coach Ted, who coaches nine and ten year olds, coaching or chatting with Coach Hartley, who coaches grown men. Big difference, but um, I have to ask you right off the top, Bob. Uh, thank you for coming on. Um, any advice for a, a very inexperienced coach like myself from you? Just remember, it's a kid's game. Like even us, like we're coaching grown men, but you know, like it's a kid's game. You know, you have to have fun. You have to work on details and make sure that you're one of the reasons why they want to come back to the ring the next day. Smiling, right? The kids need to smile. All the time. Okay, so yourself, you're smiling this morning. Uh, tell me why. It's excitement building up to the home opener. You guys must be raring to go. I know there's usually um, a theme that coaches like to come up with with, the, with, his, with their guys. Is there a theme for this year's team, kind of an attitude? Well, you know, like our slogan, it's always earned, never given. But at the same time, our message to our guys, like throughout the summer, uh, throughout training camp was, let's pick up where we ended last year. Like our, our work ethic, this is non-negotiable. This is part of life. Like, you know, like to, to work hard should not be something that, wow, so, you know, people are amazed from this. We're paid to work hard. After this, like, it's all about execution, about details, about making sure that we put on the ice a quality product for our fans because we're very fortunate. We're part of a growing city that we feel that they're right behind us and we want to make them proud. One guy who's really kind of stepped up during the preseason and must have worked out hard in the offseason, Johnny Goudreau. Tell me about him. I mean, he's going to be skating, isn't he? Yeah, like uh, Johnny is, uh, you know, like has been like, uh, you know, like a, a real nice addition to our hockey club. Like, uh, you know, fought hard during training camp, made his way. And, uh, you know, like looking at this, I think he's a great example for all small players. Like, uh, you know, for kids in minor hockey in Calgary that, you know, coaches or, you know, like parents are saying you're too small to play. You know, like Johnny's the example to follow. You know, like uh, we have Paul Byron also, you know, like, it's not always the size. It's, you know, like the fight that you put in the game, the passion that you put in, and he's a special player. It's not always the size, the fight you put into the game. I'm going to tell you so much, Coach Hartley. Good luck this season. Good luck on Wednesday. We hope you guys all the best this year. Um, we're going to head back to the studio now, Tara. Look at that. A very, very experienced coach <laughs> giving advice to a very, very rookie coach. And hopefully I can translate to the little guys when I hit the ice tomorrow. Yeah, well, it certainly applies to everyone. Ted, you're back in the studio tomorrow. And we want to remind people, catch it on Sportsnet if they can't make it down. But if they can make it down, cheer loud, right? Cheer loud, that's for sure. Get your tickets. It's going to be great on Wednesday. All right, so, uh, Ted, we'll see you tomorrow.